Updated March 22, 2019 22 hours 13 minutes and 5 seconds The Broncos dominate the Cowboys to earn bragging rights in their thriving NRL rivalry, while the Storm celebrate victory over the Raiders in Canberra. Pangai Jr. inspires Broncos Queensland Derby win a powerhouse display from Tevi to Pangai Jr. has helped guide Brisbane to a 29-10 win over a battered and bruised North Queensland at a Pack Lang Park. Pangai Jr. was a man on a mission, monstering the Cowboys to help open Brisbane's 2019 winning account in front of 45,023 spectators. North Queensland had no answer to Pangai Jr.'s heroics especially after inspirational lock Jason Taumalolo suffered a knee injury early in the second round clash. Former Dally M medalist Tamalolo was not given a chance to back up his phenomenal 301 run meters effort in North. Queensland's first round win over St George Illawarra, suffering a medial knee complaint in his first hit up of the match. He bravely battled on however did not return to the field in the second half. In another worry for Cowboys coach Paul Green, winger Nene McDonald and utility John Asiata also failed to finish the match with head knocks, forcing a backline reshuffle that at one stage left second row a Mitch Dunn at pivot. Angai Jr. was relegated to the bench in Brisbane's first round loss to Melbourne after battling back from a hamstring injury. But the live wire forward looked like he wanted to prove a point after being thrown a starting front row berth by new coach Anthony Seibold, stepping up for the suspended Matt Lodge. He played like a man possessed, pulling off hit after hit to leave North Queensland shell-shocked from the outset, and finished with a total of 115 run metres while also helping himself to a 47th minute try. Broncos centre James Roberts proved he was over a back injury that cut short his first round clash, nabbing a try scoring double along with winger Corey Oates. The Broncos grabbed a 10 0 half time lead before kicking on with Oates, scoring his 12th try in six matches, and Roberts helping himself to the eighth double of his career. North Queensland did not get on the board until ex-Bronco Jordan Kahu crashed over in the 60th minute. Storm unbeaten after win over Riders Melbourne remains undefeated after star wing Asuli Arsivunavalu's hat-trick inspired the Storm to a 22-10 victory over Canberra. Vunavalu was unstoppable at Canberra Stadium in the Round 2 clash on Friday night, running in his third try after 30 minutes to stun the Raiders. After keeping Gold Coast scoreless in their Round 1 win, Canberra had no answers to the force of the Storm, who look at as fearsome as ever despite the retirements of stars Billy Slater and Ryan Hoffman. Craig Bellamy's men did all the attacking during the first 40 minutes, taking full advantage of their possession dominance. Melbourne grabbed a 14-0 halftime lead and skipper Cameron Smith extended that buffer with a penalty goal early in the second half. But the Raiders were able to work their way into the contest, with a special try. In the 50th minute to captain Jared Croker giving the home side's fans some hope. But some rusty play in attack, combined with typical gritty storm defending, snuffed out any raised expectations from the Raiders. Melbourne prop Nelson Asso for Solomon are all but closed the door on a Raiders comeback when he barged over for his team's fourth try in the 60th minute. Croker grabbed a consolation try with 10 minutes remaining for a double to continue his impressive returned to the team after a serious knee injury at the end of last season. The surprise early return of winger Jordan Rapana following a shoulder reconstruction was a major positive for Canberra.
NRL ladder up, ABC Topics, Sport, Rugby League, NRL, Canberra 2600, Melbourne 3000, Brisbane 4000, Townsville 4810 First posted March 22, 2019 17 hours 24 minutes and 27 seconds.